Hello, it's Mr. K again. I'm going to come up with a couple of scientific ideas which I've come out with in the past, but I want to express it on YouTube. Okay, first idea. Just imagine light passing through a prism, a glass prism. It has a refraction of different spectrums of light. Maybe we can combine technology where we can refract light through indicated points around our body like a prism through a prism and carry out a spectrum of light emission around us if we could statically charge electrically charged magnetically charged the reflection refractions of light we could develop shields for different types of uh, preventative uh, strike measures you know i mean if we could actually um if we could actually uh, develop the technology we could actually reflect light through, through a, a prism combination th throughout our body and uh, statically, electrically and magnetically charge these refractions of light to, to, to make a shield around us. A, 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 an electromagnetic shield, a magnetic shield or an electrostatic uh, uh, sh shield or barrier around our body. There are different spectrums of light through a light prism. So there are different combination of reflective refractive light which we can statically charge and magnetically charge and electrically charge around our bodies to actually allow a uh, an emission of a field around us maybe we might be able to block missiles through throughout from, from, our, from around our own bodies by reflecting reflecting a statically magnetic and electrically charged field around us to a, a great length or width or circumference grid around us where we could I mean, prevent strikes on, on soldiers and en entering enemy battlefields or soldiers trying to prevent missile strikes on, the, on their positions or even to block frequencies or electromagnetic frequencies or, or programming language to, to, to pass like a control measured point around us. I mean, we might have sensitive equipment around us and we might be able to develop a statically, electrically, and magnetically charged static field through, through light entering a prism around us, and we could block programming or programming language or wavelengths or electrostatic, electrostatic or electromagnetic programming or frequencies entering our vicinity through that that uh, that type of capability. So that's one idea. The second idea is. Just imagine we want to find invisibly lined ships, ghost ships, or invisible people with cloaked material on them, walking around our borders or areas or wherever. Maybe we have a, a, a problem with cloaked people, invisible people with wearing cloaked frequency laced material, and we're trying to detect them. Basically, if we build a satellite which is able to emit high photonic frequency, high density frequencies, I mean, um, to a Pacific circumferential grid around our border or within our uh, within one Pacific area, if we intensify frequencies, angular velocity, angular motion, and intensify it, grind away those frequencies around uh, a Pacific area, we may be able to create light impact zones, frequency impact zones on frequency material, so we can expose people wearing cloaked material. Because when 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 high density frequencies uh, are emitted off a, a frequency material, it will it will lighten up the the, the uh, appearance of an individual. Same with ghost ships. If the satellite emits high photonic electromagnetic frequencies or uh, high photonic frequencies, light charged frequencies down to the ground around our uh, our sea borders or our borders, we could see the movement of ghost ships or invisible lined material or invisibility would come to uh, come to uh, fruition we would be able to see these these types of activities more clearer around our our, uh, our sea borders or our borders or within our within the areas of our country remember when high density frequencies angular velocity angular velocity angular angular motion style grinding frequencies in a circular motion 
frequency uh, grinding in high density frequencies uh, around a Pacific area or circumfloral grid or navel or a uh, root, we would be able to carry out light charge frequencies across frequency material and reflect or see I mean the appearance of, of ghost ships or invisible line material because the high density frequencies will rebound off the frequency material and cause a light emission from the, the material so we could act actively seek and hunt cloaked material that is in within our, within our vicinity or within our ionosphere within within our within our groundworks i mean from our ionosphere uh, and uh, the next idea i was going to think of i've just forgotten about it um Ooh, I think that's it for now, but I will come back to you at a later date with more information. And hopefully you've enjoyed my science and physics related um, terminolo terminology guided ideas. I'm just trying to pass ideas here. Thank you very much. Bye bye.